Okie dokie, hello, and welcome back to Hogwarts. I figured out how to open these. It's actually fairly simple once you know the solution. I remember last stream, I was saying something like, oh, that one's one, two, three, four. No. That's a zero. One, two, three, four. Once you know that, you know pretty much all of the answers if you know basic math. Right. What was I doing? What am I going to do? Let's see. Uh, ba -ba -ba -ba, breaking camp? Sure. Where's the map? There we go. Map. The world map. Alright, so these two places? Yeah. Gonna go over here. Here we go. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before. I... It's like a place right out of a storybook. There's some chests around here. I think they're behind locked doors. Yeah. I don't have a thing to open up doors yet that are locked. Uh, oh, floating hat. It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my guard. Right. Let's head this way, I suppose. Rebellion. Any treasure? No. Okay, this way. I gotta clear out some camps. Do, 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 do. Let's see what we're dealing with. Doesn't seem too bad. One of Ranrock's camps, exactly as Madame Beaumont described. One less shoe to worry about. Some of them taken out. One less shoe to worry about. This is where you will fail. Arrogant child. Stupid. Ow. There's a whole bunch of them. There we go. That was easy. Ranrock has fooled you all to your demise. One camp down, one more to go. Any goodies for me? Is that it? I think that's it. On to the next one. Hmm. 
Most goblins in my family worked in the mines at one time or other. Cleared. Adam Beaumont will be glad to hear that. Oh yeah. Another success. Rebellion. Success. Right. Uh, I'm gonna check around to see if there's any more goodies to take. Ooh. These rocks have seen better What's days. What's this? Strange. Uh. What's this about? No idea. Incendio. Ooh. Slippery. Hello, welcome to stream. I have no idea what I'm doing. Uh, I don't, I don't need any custom stuff. Thank you very much.
Alright, we're almost there. Mm, jump. Not sure how I'd fare in a little. Hello. I do miss the bus. Hello, Madame Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You cleared them out? How? It was harrowing, and they dug in their heels, but I managed. I already said no oh, thanks. I wish my brother could have done what you did. Perhaps he'd still be with me now. I'm especially grateful. You did for Bardolf what I could not. You saved our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. What do you have for sale? What are you looking for exactly? Thank you. Sincerely. Marvelous. I could always use more of these. Thank you for passing through. Oh, I can select this now that I'm level 16. There we go. What are you looking for exactly? Thank you for passing through. I still can't believe that Bardolph has joined me. All right, where am I going now? I could do this one. Uh, I'll go here. Off on another adventure, are we? <coughs> Ooh. Akio. Ooh, paper. Hidden Herbology Corridor. Oh, Revelio. So where's the secret entrance? I wonder. Oh, below. Okay, I gotta go below.
What's this? Revelio. These dry vines are one spark away from becoming kindling. Incendio. Aha! I found the way in. This must be the entrance to the hidden herbology corridor. Devil's snare seems to thrive in darkness. Oh, uh oh. Perhaps it doesn't care for light. Oh, oh. Careful. Oh, I didn't want to put it on B. Lumos. Here we go. Spooky. Incendio. Light the place up, get the treasure. Here we go. <coughs> Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. Lumos. Seems the devil was protecting a chest of some kind. Incendio. Fire. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. And push. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. I imagine a piece of that enormous venomous tentacular would be enough for Duncan to prove his bravery. Ooh, that's a big plant. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. Incendio. Lumos. There we go. Light the place up. <coughs> Incendio. Lumos. Ooh. Big treasure. Revelio Lumos
Right. Let's go turn in this thing. What was that noise? Oh, it's a key. Follow the key. Where is it going to take me? Aha. Uh, smack! Hooray! Have you found anything to... Uh, prove my bravery yet? Yeah. Hello, Duncan. I have the proof you wanted. That's one leaf. Must have been a giant venomous tentacular. It's even more than I expected. I knew you were the one to ask. I appreciate you getting it for me. Of course. I hope this helps you prove yourself. This is sure to put an end to Puff's in Dunking for good when I show everyone in the common room tonight. This will show ever how ridiculous that nickname was. Thank you again, and have a good day. I know I will. Thank you for all of your help. No more puff scheme dunking for me. Nice. Alright, where am I going now? Quest. Uh... That one? Floating candles to find the treasure. Okay. Okay. That could be anywhere here. Uh, is that Hogsmeade? I have no idea. But we can have a look around, see what we can find. Hogsmeade, here I come. I don't know if I'm gonna go the right direction, but I'm gonna look around anyway. I don't think it's this way. I think it's more over here. Uh, oh, it's probably here, right? I'm looking for a bridge with candles. Ah, this looks like the right thing. Okay, where's my map? Ah, uh, okay, so, Forbidden Forest. Uh, Alright, on the stone bridge, Lumos, Candles, okay. Lumos. This isn't a stone bridge. 
That's a stone bridge. Oh. Enchanted candles. Wonder where they're heading. Follow the candles. The candles seem to be leading into the forbidden forest. Oh no. That's where spiders are. The treasure must be nearby. I suppose a picnic at the treasure hunting suits hey. me. Nice. More goodies for me. Hooray. That's a fancy robe. Keep it on for now. Alright, let's do this. No, it's not far at all. I'm on the right track. Lumos. Squirrels. Lumos. Right, it's just around here. A castle. Must have been quite stately in its time. Oh, that's creepy. You're gonna regret coming here. Am I? Here I am, as good as my word. Hello. We meet again, Richard Jackdaw. I suppose I shouldn't be surprised to see you. It would take the patience of a Hufflepuff to track down these pages. Well said. Now, where do we go from here? Follow me. I shall lead you as far as I can, but I fear I may remain a tad reluctant to revisit the scene of my demise. Keep your eyes open for a birdbath. When you find it, say Intramuros. I think it's Latin. Intramuros. Or Greek. As you can imagine, I never paid much attention in school. Shall we? Um. Okay. Aside from the bird bath, anything else I should look for? Indeed. A few landmarks. A stone bridge, a waterfall, and, if I recall, a lake. You'll see. You've been very helpful. Thank you. Surprising how much of this is rather unfortunately coming back to me. Hmm. Yes. You know, the closer we get, the spider more I'm fight time. Probably best I leave you to it. Yeah, spider <laughs> fight time. Incendio. Alright, uh. Sure. Ow. Ow. 
See these. I guess I'll try again. What are you up to now? You have cabbages. Love your soul. Akio. That hurt. <laughs> oh, this is a big guy. Okay. I can't lift him up. There we go. There's a victory that came on too soon. Ugh. Incendio. Fire burn. The waterfall. For a thief, Jackdaw's surprisingly as good as his word. Pretty. Something oddly solemn about this place. Such regal creatures, stags. This place looks nice. There it is. Just as Jackdaw described. You can't Rebellion. imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. Incendio. Intramuros. Open sesame. Aren't you a little far oh, from hello. Renrock knew you'd eventually lead us to whatever it is you're hiding. But <laughs> Oh, he's drowned. No risk those loyalists will report back to Ranrock now. Let's see where Jack Dora's led me. His tomb. Mmm. I wonder how big this place is. Spooky. Impressive. 
suddenly a bridge. Someone didn't want casual visitors down here. I wonder if any of my spells will help me through this. I mean like a fire spell to burn. Incendio! Potato! Accio! Stupid boy! Accio! Incendio! Bad spider. Oh. Yucky. I'm not gonna touch those. Ugh. Protego. Akio. Stupid one. Oh, there's a lot of them. Stupid one. Incendio. Akio. Get out of here. Is it all of them? I think I got all of them. Give me the treasure. Ah. Uh -huh. Goody. Right, I'm gonna put those on there. Uh -huh. I don't want to change how they look. There we go. Oh, good. All right, continue down this way. Hey, what's going on over here? If I could summon that platform to me, I could likely get on it. Ah. Spiders. Oh. Incendio. Got to get a jump on me. I burn you. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Right, so I want to do Accio. Accio. Yeah. Okay, uh, nice. That's odd. I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot, but there's no sign of him. Hmm. Treasure. Spiders. Incendio. I wish Incendio had more range. Symbol is hidden somewhere. Hidden so oh, it's up there. Remarkable. Mm, spooky bridge. Let's go. No, not there. Oh, there's lots of little ones everywhere. Yucky. Huh. 
Not a headless skeleton in sight. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. Headless skeletons, you say? Oh, another one of these. It's a good thing Jackdaw didn't fall down there. I'm glad Richard Jackdaw left a little something behind for me, but where could he be? Oh, it's over here. I wonder. Incendium. Oh yeah, the low range. Gotta get closer to do that. Ta da! An untouched chest. Tactile wasn't very thorough in his search of his cave. Potato! Stoop to fight! Incendium! Incendium! Dirty little spiders. Accio. Incendio. Potato. Stupid one. Get away from me. Not a headless skeleton in Ceramic sight. mask. Hmm, but I may as well help myself to this. All right, try not to run off the edge of this floating platform. Incendio. Accio. murder and more treasure that's odd I'd have thought Jackdaw would have been interested in this loot but there's no sign of him there's a lot of pathways to take Ah, I wonder which one's the main path, so I don't go down it first. Treasure. I like the treasure. Is that it? I think that's it. Uh, go around this way. Well, not that way, but you know, around this way. There it is. The bridge, it's almost complete. Spiders. More spiders. He's caught more bad with the jack. Potato! Stupid one! Stupid one! Ah! In 
incendiary. Stupid. There we go. Ugh. Shame you're so fat. Oh, bigger ones again. There's two of them this time. Incendiary. Potato. Stupid. Akio. Ow. Oh, I killed him already. The big ones didn't need to take much damage. Farewell, monster. I can only imagine how these spiders have multiplied since Jackdaw came this way. I right, gotta pick up all the treasure. Glad Richard Jackdaw left me something behind for me, but where could he be? <coughs> I need to look around. There's for one more somewhere. Somewhere. Could the last one be? It's not that, is it? That? Right, before I activate that again, I need to see where the last one is. Could be anywhere. be too far. That would be silly if it was. Where could it be? Up here? Can't go in there. Where's the last one? There's one there. One there. One there. Oh, maybe I just didn't do it fast enough. Yeah, I don't think I did it fast enough. But I did it this time. Yeah, you know what it is. Black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow, black and yellow. Must be yellow. getting closer to Jack Doll's remains and those pages. We meet again, Richard Jack Doll. Thank you for keeping these pages safe all these oh, years. Oh, he got murdered. Here it is. The map that brought your doom, Jackdaw. It's hmm. absolutely demolished. Is there something beyond this room? Oh, the knights are waking up. Quick, get the treasure. Oh. Smitey. Protego, stupid one. Ah! Incendio. They 
is too far away for him to see you. Aha. Oh no, big man time. Mr. Big and Angry. Whoa. Go cabbage. Incendio. Go cabbage. Cabbage for the win. Incendio. Ha ha ha. Get out of here. Aha. What? That's some nothing. Oh. What's happening? It turns into a gateway. I've seen this before. The green gods and the restricted section. Oh, spooky doorway. Starting to flood. Uh oh. That's no good. Let me move. How am I being protected? What sort of magic oh. is this? Magic bubble. Ah. A good magic bubble. I can only hope this magic protects me until I'm able to make my way out of here. Open. What is this place? This looks like arena. There's gonna be a boss in here, right? It looks like an um, arena. Hello. Can it be? Hey, it's these guys. Right? It's you. Has someone finally found our map chamber? I recognize you from the pensives. You're Professor Rackham. I am indeed. I must confess that I am surprised to see someone so young standing before me. I'm the same age that you and Isadora Morganark were when you started at Hogwarts. You've paid attention. And... Might I presume you share our ability? To see traces of ancient magic? Yes, sir, I do. As you have likely realized by now, our ability gives us a unique relationship with all forms of magic. We can access expressions of magic that few others can. Opportunities will arise that allow you to sharpen this rare talent. Do not squander them. I won't, Professor. Thank you. We have much to discuss, but first, a map found in a certain book led you here. Place the book on the pedestal. I don't have the book with me, sir. Hmm, that is unfortunate. I'm afraid we must pause our conversation until you return with the book. Okay. Very well. I'll retrieve the book right away. Good. We <coughs> shall speak again once the book is in place. I gotta go fetch. Your connection to ancient magic has unlocked talents. You receive one talent point each time you increase your wizarding level. Uh, your new talent points just uh, okay. Uh oh. You earn talent points starting at level five. Oh, I have twelve. Okay. Find the map chamber as a Hufflepuff. That means I have to do multiple playthroughs if I want to get 
all the achievements. What's this? Oh, ring of fire. Fire burn. Hmm. Dark hearts. Ooh. Ooh, I want that. Let me dash. It's a nice spell set. Sure. And I want this as well. I want this. And that. And that. Ah, 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 Burst. There we go. Magic. Found the pages and the map chamber. Ooh.
Unidentified back item. Take this to the room of requirement to reveal its qualities. Okay. <laughs> red mask. I like the red mask. It's very nice. Ooh. Oh. That's nice. Hey, a fast travel. That's nice. Incendio. Oh, I've got a big ring of fire now when I use my incendio. I'm back at Hogwarts. I wonder when Professor Fig will be back. I did promise him I wouldn't neglect my studies while he was away. Suppose I have enough to distract myself with till he returns with the book. Uh -huh. Oh, there's the key. All the way back over here. charm. Useful for pushing objects or adversaries away. Complete the required tasks and meet me in my classroom. Okay. Brilliant. Another house token. Nice. Oh, there's another one. Where's it going? Oh, it's right there. Fair enough. Ah. Yes. Oh yeah. Got to collect all these house tokens. I hear another one. Where is it? There it is. Where'd it go? Oh, it went up. Now where's it gone? Oh, I, need, I can hear it in there. Oh, no, it's over here. Never mind. Found it. Another one! Musical frogs. Revelio. Oh. Revelio. Where am I going again?
I've always said that travel broadens the mind. All right. Uh. Up, 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 up. Spider Slayer suit. <laughs> yeah, armor. <laughs> I'm playing Dark Souls. We can wear this over it as well. Ooh. <laughs> nice. <laughs> be a knight <laughs> that's cool oh flying class Ooh. acquire and use a fo uh, focus potion uh, acquire Maxima and Endurous Potions and use them simultaneously. Okay. I get to go to flying school. I get to learn to fly. It's not that far away. Oh, it's right there. If it isn't the treasure, don't want to leave you found that. Arthur! Well done. Hi, Arthur. You're my best friend. I love you, Arthur. Everybody grab a broom and we shall get started. Okay. Mr. Clopton, your attention, please. Sorry, Madam Kagawa. Everyone, please welcome a new student to our flying class. Welcome. Hello. Hello. The goal of today is to remind all of you how to maneuver on a broomstick safely, as broom flight is, first and foremost, a means of transportation. This, I fear, some of you have forgotten. Diving, rolling, and loop-the-loops will not be taught or in fact tolerated in this class. We'll leave that to professional Quidditch players, like the Toyohashi Tengu. Boo. Not a fan, I take it? Now, let's see how well everyone kept up with their practice over the summer holidays. For those who need a refresher, step up to your broom, say up firmly and clearly, then kick your leg over and rest your weight on the seat. Up! Thank you. 
Now. Hey. Your turn. Let's go. Up. 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 up you stupid ratty school brood. Rude. Sit up nicely. Up. Yeah. One leg over, so there's a leg on each side. None of that side saddle nonsense. A gust of wind will throw you right off. Up. I'm flying! And if you hear my whistle while you're in flight, ground yourself at once. Oh. Good. Now. Hey. First lesson, fly through each ring in the courtyard. Okay. Do take oh, this care. This will take some getting the used to. The rooms are school property. <laughs> Wish I had I my own I want them room. returned in one piece. Nice. Well done. Now that you're acclimatized to your brood, the controls like let's an RC see how controller. you manage with a more advanced Like exercise. a remote control helicopter or something, like a drone. This next set of rings will take you around the grounds for more of a challenge. What a view! Hey. <laughs> Hello! Hello! Nice day for a fly! Yes, it is. Made it! <laughs> <sighs> Did anyone else see hey. that? <laughs> oh, the old boathouse. Wish you could have experienced crossing the lake as a first year. Yeah, that would have been cool. If I could like start at the first years and like make my way up. There we go. Whoa! Our aquatic resident likes to make an appearance once in a while. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this is so cool! <laughs> Yeah. I say, I watched you fly through those rings. You seem to handle yourself on that dusty school broom well enough. I'd imagine you're ready for something a bit more challenging. But I'm getting ahead of myself. We haven't properly met. I'm Everett Clockton. Hello. Am I right in suspecting that a Hufflepuff like you might be interested in some high flying fun? Yes. I can't say no to that. What did you have in mind? A bit of a detour, so to speak. Follow me. Okay. The tour is about to begin. Where's he going? Follow closely now. Right now, we're flying over the Transfiguration Courtyard. <laughs> Lovely. Let's hope the headmaster isn't having tea by the window today. <laughs> Yeehaw! Nice to get above it all, isn't it? Ow. <laughs> Ahead of the gardens, the Hufflepuff common room windows just peek out. Bit claustrophobic for my taste. How is ever a flight so quickly? Here's something handy to know. Lean forward for a burst of speed. Helpful if you need to escape a tricky situation. Lean forwards. Uh. There's the famous bridge. Think of all the magic holding it up. I mean, look at it. And the owlery. That's a bit of solid architecture, isn't it? Flying tips and the jaunt around Hogwarts. This is quite. So let me toggle the flight speed. Yeah. And where have you two been? 
Oh, hello, Professor. We were trying to get a bit of extra practice in. Hefty points will be taken from each of you for not following my instructions. Mr. Clopton, I am disappointed in you. You're in this class because you're still because you're still not showing yourself, or frankly, your broom the proper respect. But, Professor. Enough. Class is finished for the day. As for you, you do well to use better judgment in the future. <laughs> Chin up. That was some rather good flying. She likes me. Yay. Sorry about that business with Kagawa. But you have to admit, those views were worth it. I had no regrets. It was worth losing a few house points for that detour. You seem at home on a broom. Bet if you had a fancy model, you could fly laps around Imelda. She's Kagawa's favorite. I could show her a thing or two if I had my own broom. Hate having to return the school broom after class. Perhaps I have to purchase a broom then. If you can, you should. Wish I could. I recommend visiting Albie Weeks at Spint Witches in Hogsmeade. He's always looking to test new models. Yes. I'll keep an eye out for you in the sky. I'm gonna go buy a broom right now. Where is it? That one. Sometimes it seems all right. How did you fare? If you're keen for some illicit spell practice, meet me outside the Defense Against the Dark Arts classroom. I know a discreet place near there. Ooh. Hello. Hello, Mr. Weeks, is it? Albie Weeks at your service. Welcome to Spin Witches. Apologies if you came back before and weren't able to come in. Shop's been closed since trade routes were disrupted. Had to travel as far as London to meet with my supplier. And I've only just returned. Thankfully, with inventory. I presume you're in the market for a new broom? Yes. Got a few rare yew weavers available. Ember dash, silver arrows. Wind wisps, too. No matter what broom you choose, you'll be pleased. They're all exceptional, both in quality and performance. I'd like to have a look. Sounds quite the array of brooms. I'll have a look around. Thank you. Please meet me in the seventh floor corridor as soon as you can. I have an idea for somewhere you can focus on your studies, away from prying eyes and distractions. Oh. That item is of the highest quality. They're very cheap. I can buy all of them. That item is of the highest quality. I'm sure they are. That item is of the highest quality. Ah. Uh. Hmm. That item is of the highest quality. I might go for this one. You You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Nice. Thanks for stopping by. Whilst nearly any broom will certainly be a step up from the practice brooms in Kagawa's class, they all have their limitations. You seem to be a flyer who might be interested in, say, some enhancements? Go on. Ha! Knew I was right about you. I think you'll be quite happy with the performance of any broom at lower altitudes. But you may notice that speed consistency tends to falter as you rise. I believe I can remedy this issue. I have some ideas for enchantments, upgrades, if you will, that will improve the performance of any broom you fly. What I need is someone to conduct a broom flight and report back to me so I can perfect the upgrades. Yes. As it happens, another Hogwarts student, Imelda Rays, is using abandoned broom courses for time trials. Clever girl. An ideal situation for collecting flight statistics. 
If you were to compete for the best time and succeed, then report back to me with how your broom behaved, I could complete work on my first upgrade. What's this? Yes. That sounds intriguing. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. It'll be worth your while. If I'm right, the new upgrade ought to enhance brooms in every regard. And I can give you a special prize. Yes. The time trial should be a bit of fun too. Go to the Quidditch pitch and Imelda Reyes will sort you out. Okay. Hello. Once you've beaten Imelda's time, be sure to let me know. Revelio. Wait. Uh... Broomstick? How do I use it? How do I broom? I can't help but admire Mr. Weeks' enthusiasm. Oh, it's because I'm in a town. I can't. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Yeah. Whee! Here we go. Hey, free rain. It's very quiet. There's no music. Can fly. Whoa, what's going on over here? Ooh. Hufflepuff. Yes. Amelda Rays? Albie Week sent me. <laughs> Did he now? Still tinkering with his broom upgrade, no doubt. I tried to help him once. He nitpicked my flying technique, <laughs> and that was the end of that. The nerve. Why is he roping you into his broom testing silliness? You've barely started flying from what I know. Caught wind of you showing off in flying class with Clopton. So jealous. Seems someone's jealous of my skills on a broom. Me, Slytherin Quidditch captain, jealous of you. Yes. Everyone knows that class is only for beginners, troublemakers, and bumbling baboons. But for some reason, now people think you're competition. Ugh, I can't be having that. Perhaps I am competition. <laughs> you're not even Slytherin. Could be a useless squib for all I know. Bruh. Enough of this. Only one way to find out who's the better flyer. I hold one of the fastest times on this course. Let's see if you can beat it. I'm gonna skin the snake. Versus Hufflepuff. Let's go. Actually, why not? I can beat your record. I'm so looking forward to seeing you lose. I'm gonna skin this fucking asshole. Ready? Go! How am I not going faster? Oh, there we go. That's a boost. Blind to the bubbles. Whee! I got this. Yeah. Let's go. Made it. Oh, oh. Now 
That's more like it. Finish line. <laughs> this is rather fun. <laughs> I agree. What's the matter? I beat your time. Uh, that's not. You, you must have cheated. You. Uh, fine. You. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Don't think this is over. Uh -huh. You can't determine uh -huh. skill from one single trial. Surely my win means something. Uh, you're not terrible, but you're still uh, going to have to prove yourself if you want to earn my respect. Why do I care about her respect? <laughs> I don't want your respect. I don't want respect from the likes of you. All you do is insult people. <laughs> you and everyone else need to get a thicker skin. Anyway, I'm moving on to the next course. It's near Irondale and offers a much tougher challenge. Really? You can try to prepare by racing this course again. Just check in at the podium where the leaderboard is. You can check your time and start the race. <laughs> we'll see next time if your win here was more than just a fluke. Whilst on an errand for Alby Weeks. Ah, here, 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 here. I beat you. I beat you, I beat you, I beat you, I beat you. Loser. Uh-huh. me to here I come. Find myself scurrying. Oh, you're Mr. Weeks, I was able to set a record on my broom. Incredible! Miss Ray's must have been shocked. Tell me, how was the broom? A little turbulent, and it's wanting for a bit of speed, but it fared well enough. I will say that it tended to drift a bit to the left on certain turns. Heard a slight swoosh when I dipped. Oh, thank you. Mm, that's precisely what I needed to know. Mm, drifted, eh? I shall get to work immediately. <laughs> Even the naysayers will be forced to admit that my work's had potential all along. I'm excited to hear more. I have a very good feeling about this upgrade. I guarantee you'll be pleased. Expect to hear from me soon. Hmm, how to address the issue of altitude as it relates to speed? What are we looking for today? Hmm. I can sell stuff while I'm here as well. That's nice. Nice doing business with you. Thanks for stopping by. Hope to see you again. Yay. With Professor Weasley. Okay. Let's go. I wanna change out of this outfit because it's silly. Hey. 
There we go. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. It's time to fly. Is there a way in through the roof? A window. I wonder if there's any secrets just laying around on the rooftops. Oh, there's a door. Can't enter whilst mounted. Why not? I want to land. I'll just fast travel, I think. Off on another adventure, are we? Yeah. Fire. Incendio. Professor Weasley. Hello. Hmm. Somewhere away from prying eyes. The wall right on your left. Right in front of you. To your right. There it is. Forgive me, the headmaster stopped me and I... Merlin's beard. I see you've wasted no time. Well done. Shall we? After you, Professor. What is this place? This is the Room of Requirement. It only appears when one is in real need of it. Ordinarily, a student might stumble upon this room entirely by accident. If ever. I'd only planned to suggest to you how to find it by walking past that bit of wall, focusing on what you need. But you've managed to reveal the room on your own. While I'm here, we should take advantage of the moment. Now. Where is Deke? He must have sneaked past and gone ahead. Deke, Professor? The house elf I was speaking to in my classroom your first day. Thought he might help you use the room once you've found it. I'm clambering over this mess. Mm. This 
presents the perfect opportunity to teach you Evanesco, the vanishing spell. You can cast Evanesco to vanish certain objects, such as these chairs and other things here in the room. I suggest you practice the wand movements first, then you can clear the chairs away. Splendid. Now, cast Evanesco on those chairs. Excellent work. You'll note that you are now in possession of Moonstone. We shall discuss its uses later. Let's move on. Where in Merlin's name is that elf? Is that... goodness? My old school bag. I wondered where that had got to. I can't believe it's still here. I'll just take a quick look at this. Give you an opportunity to explore on your own until we locate Deke. Yes, Professor. Oh, dear me. Can't you keep it down? Some of us are trying to rest. I hope this isn't as precarious as it looks. An intruder! Stop them! No, not... Uh, that's not helpful, you worthless pile of tin! Rest in peace. <laughs> Bit offended the room thought I needed a bath, cheeky thing. How does anyone other than a house elf manage to get around in here? What's that? What was that? It was a snitch. Was that a golden snitch? What's that doing in here? Perhaps you should summon your wits and find out. <laughs> Accio. Eh. Where is it to? I don't know where it's gone.
I don't think I was supposed to be able to walk up here. But I'm doing it anyway. Or not. I don't know. They can't use magic to get rid of the wall. Um, where do I go from here? Do I bring the back? Oh, okay. I bring it back through. I bring this back through. I know what to do. Akio. Come on. Over here. Bruh. Come on. Don't be like that. Why'd it have to rotate for? Hmm. No. Rotate. Rotate. Just ro just rotate. Oh come on. You're doing me dirty. Oh come on. Ugh. Stream out. <sighs> Can I rotate it? <coughs> Come on, game. Let me rotate this thing. Push it back through. No! Go in. Ah. Uh. This game hates me. Drop it. Put it down. 
Level yourself. Damn. Ugh. Okay. There we go. No! Why? Why are you like this? I don't want to lift that. I want to lift a fucking set of this side table thing. It's in the way. down don't rotate there we go that was so difficult I'm gonna slide it all the way through now Very slowly. Very slowly. Let me over. Bruh. Are you for serious? Oh, come on. Why can't I climb over this? What? What's going on? I can climb up this. Was I supposed to have gone this way? Oh. Bruh. It's not helpful. I want to jump over and get the snitch. Self can find us in here.
There it is. Yikes! Careful! Huh? Oh, there you are. Wait right there. Deke will come to you. Hello. Ah, oh, Deke, we've been looking for you. Uh, apologies, Professor Weasley. Deke was looking through some of what's appeared in the room since Deke was last here. Is this the student? Indeed it is. Deke is honored to meet you. Hello. Deke has been a friend since I was a second year. We discovered this room together. I mentioned you to Deke. We believe that you might be able to benefit from this room like I did. Deke, would you be so kind? Of course, Professor Weasley. The room of requirement will always be equipped for the Seeker's needs. It's unplottable, so won't appear on any map. <coughs> Most happened upon it by accident, if ever. <coughs> Deke seen students in need of an extra file for potions Hello, stumble upon the room filled with them. You seem to have accessed it in its form as the room of hidden things. I was thinking about needing a place away from prying eyes. <laughs> Brilliant. Oh, that explains it then. What I need specifically is a place where I can catch up on my schoolwork without distraction. Well then, the room can provide you with precisely that. Now, it's time to focus on what you need. Just close your eyes. Imagine the room precisely as you need it. The room will do the rest. given yourself quite a canvas to work with hey i look forward to seeing what you do with the space ah all right i'll be right back I'll be right back
Okie dokie, hello, I'm back. Alright. I'm ready to continue. What have we got? Who is my one viewer? Is it you, Kent? Are you Who's my one viewer? You with a desk of description. Excellent. It can identify unfamiliar items of clothing. One should always understand the effects of anything in which one is clothed. Identify. Boat. You'll find plenty of items of clothing that need to be identified. The desk will be an invaluable resource. I imagine the desk of description will come in handy. It will. I hope you'll take advantage of it. Now, I'll give you a brief lesson in conjuring. The room might not provide everything you need on its own. Conjuring? Yes, the magic of creating or conjuring objects. I'll teach you. Spell. Avada Kedavra. Hooray. Very good. When conjuring more complex objects, you'll need what's called a spellcraft. Spellcrafts are like recipes. They list the ingredients or resources needed to conjure a particular object. You should have acquired some for a potion station and potting table from tomes and scrolls uh, in Hogsmeade. I did. Where can I find the resources I need? While resources such as Moonstone can be obtained throughout the Highlands, it's much safer and easier to purchase them. They can also be collected by vanishing objects in the room, such as the chairs you vanished earlier. In fact, you should have enough resources for now. I see. Can I regain resources by vanishing something I've already conjured? You can indeed. Hmm, quite perceptive. Why don't you give it a try? Go ahead and conjure the potion station and potting table. You should find both familiar since they'll resemble the ones you've already used to study magical plants and brew potions in class. Yay. Okay. Poof. 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 Haha. <laughs> I can just remove things. Interesting. Ooh. 
Well done. You can use these whenever you need to brew potions or grow plants. Presuming, of course, you've collected any seeds or potion ingredients you need in Hogsmeade or outside the castle grounds. Ooh. Deke will be here to answer any questions you may have. Do not underestimate his insights. Thank you. I will be sure to speak with Deke if I need anything. Thank you. Good luck. I shall linger a bit longer in case you'd like to learn another transfiguration spell for use in the room. Yes. Show me. I'm ready for the next lesson, Professor. Very well. First, you'll need to gather some moonstone. You can acquire it by vanishing items here in the room of requirement, or you can gather it carefully outside of the Hogwarts grounds. Return <coughs> to me once you've gathered enough, and we shall begin the lesson. Ba -ba 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 -ba. I have the moonstone you requested, Professor. Good. Then we may begin your lesson. You can conjure more than potions and herbology tables. Conjuration can be used to decorate this space to your liking. Why don't you try it on the walls and floor? Conjure wall and floor decorations. Rebellion. Okay. Ooh. Size. Oh, big mirror. That is a big, big mirror. I can imagine spending hours just messing around with decorations like these. <laughs> Chain size. Oh my! <laughs> Big chair. A went big chair. <laughs> That's funny. Magic. Oh, I 
done yet? Apparently not. Baby, there. floor decorations. conjured everything I can. What's next, Professor? I think you're ready to take on alteration. The altering spell will allow you to customize any conjured item. You can change the colors, patterns, and styles of your furniture to suit your taste. Let's get started, shall we? Okay. Watch closely as I demonstrate how to perform the altering spell. Alright. There we go. Just aim your wand at any conjured item and perform the to customize it. ready for something a little more advanced. You can use the altering spell directly on the room's architecture. Try these new designs on the floor or balcony. Ooh. Try aiming at the floor or at that balcony. Oh. Your space might benefit from a bit of ambiance, don't you think? Would you mind? Of course, Professor Weasley. Professor Weasley showed Deke this bit of magic some years ago. Deke <coughs> will enjoy it. Uh, come and talk to Deke when you're ready. Professor Weasley said I should ask you about changing the room's ambience? Of course. Uh, what sort of overall look most appeals to you? I would like the room to feel as if it's being lit by the moon. Oh, sounds perfect. Night time. Quite a difference. Of course, you needn't keep this style if you don't like it. You can always ask Deke to change it back. Now you have learned a good bit about alteration. Thank you, Professor. The room is full of possibilities. Indeed. No matter how much time I spend here, the room always manages to surprise me. Ooh. 
all this space to customize. An even bigger space. How did that happen? The room equips itself to your needs. It must have sensed that you needed more space to practice spell casting. If you'd like to customize the space further, you can use these spellcrafts. You'll find more of them both inside and outside the school. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep an eye out. Good. I'll leave you to it. This is your space now. Use it wisely. Yeah. I'd like to ask you about changing the room's ambience. Of course. Yeah. What sort of overall look most appeals to you? I'd like the room to feel natural and earthy as though I'm outdoors. Oh, sounds perfect. He. <laughs> Tiny chairs. Hmm. Interesting. There's a lot of space. I don't know why I'd need that much space. <laughs> but I have it, I guess.
Pretty. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Cat. everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. Have a good look around. Hello, Mr. Pippin. You need help with the delivery? Yes, I do. A capable student such as yourself should have no trouble making the trip to Cambridge. It's just south of Hogwarts. What do you need delivered? Fatima Lawang ordered a few invisibility potions. I used to go myself, but lately Fatima has taken to turning every visit into an argument. Constantly complaining about the quality of my stock. But how can I maintain excellence when she orders so often, giving me no time to brew? If you'd take this rather irritating task off my hands, I'd happily allow you to claim the delivery fee from Fatima. I'd be happy to help with the delivery. You've no idea how grateful I am, truly. Here are the invisibility potions she requested. Hopefully she won't give you too much trouble. She's a talented potioner in her own right. I dare say I wouldn't mind having a look at her potion recipes one day. Is that youth? <laughs> Is that euthanism? What can I do for you today? Mm. A wise decision. Thank you. Potions. <laughs> Trust 
controls boogies. Yeah. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. What do I have to do for one of the missions? Uh, focus, Maxima, and Juris. Okay. What can I do for you today? Focus. A wise decision. Thank Andrews. you. I hope to see you again. Stoned. Quest. resource indeed your field guide I'm most pleased to be included when Professor Sharp is so intimidating. Oh, sure. Coming along. I completed your assignments, Professor. Good. <laughs> you should be ready to learn De Pulso. Let's see what you can do. De Pulso. Concentrate. Do not let your mind wander. <sighs> You've got it now. If you'd like to practice, and I think you should, perhaps best not to go. De Pulso. Mates about the halls. I suggest having a go at the enchanted books here. Yeah. Well done. I'm glad to see that you seem determined to master your spell. Rebellion. La 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 la.
Oh, I gotta go on a road trip. Seems a pleasant enough little place. Yay. Revelio. Hello, Mr. Semi. What can I do for you? Semi. What do you have for sale? What can I help you with today? I'll have no trouble selling this. I hope to see you again sometime. Da 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 I'm on a flying broom. I like how I can just fly over everything and just inspect what's going on. Revelio. I wonder who lives here. Oh, we we'll that pippin. Whoa. That's a dragon. Revelio. Should have been here by now. Hello, Madam Luang. I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him, did he? Always cutting corners and taking the easy way out. Did he have you brew them for him as well? Doesn't matter. You could probably do it better than he can anyway. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so simple? I know Pippin is always trying to cheat his customers. Cutting corners to save some galleons for himself at the expense of quality. You'll not be getting a canut out of me until you prove the potion works. Oh, uh, Drink what? it. Uh, Seems simple enough. I'll do it. I should think so. Okay. It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps combining your recipes and skills? Ha! <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. I'll not give him the benefit of my hard work and gumption. If he fails on his own, so be it. Very well. I shall let Mr. Pippin know I delivered the potions as requested. You do that. What do you have for sale? 
What are we looking for today? This will do just fine. Thank you for stopping in. I appreciate it. Alright, we've got another outfit to put on. Fancy pants. See one. Complete the tasks I've given you and then meet me in my classroom to learn Defindo, the severing charm. It's typically used to cut an object, but can be a powerful weapon when needed. Rebellion. Uh. What's this one all about? Not sure how I'd fare in a little place like this. Only Brook.
Seems a pleasant enough little place. Revelio. What's this thing about? Oh. Akio. Levioso, de Pulsa. Won't get the best of me. Hooray. Pretty big map. Hello, Dragonetti. I'll show you exactly what you missed. La da 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 I wonder what these flying balloons are for. Let's fly into them and find out.
<laughs> oh, challenge a lot. Okay. Did I find the missing pages? Uh, I don't know. I had the same amount as I had last time. What do you have in store for me this time? Let me down. There you go. Revelio. That's the puzzle. Incendio. Oh, there's another one somewhere, right? It's not just that one. Oh, I see. I see where it is. Incendium. It's too slow. You just remembered something. Incendio. The channel rewards were sound. Oh yeah. What about them? Protego. Incendio. I kind of wanted to text the speech to get the paper. Incendium. Oh, there's another one there. Incendium. Levios. Oh, but that one's already like low down. Okay. So I have to do this one first. Incendium. Incendium. Not so tricky after all, Merlin. I did it. Where was I going? Oh, I may as well get that fast travel point right there. Let me answer. Oh, 
Oh, it's a fireplace. Off on another one. adventure, are we? Ah. What's the objective now? Uh in the shadows of the undercroft. I gotta meet with Sebastian. Acquire and use invisibility. Acquire use thunderbird. Okay. I ran out of invisibility. Oh, I got a uh, place that I can customize now. I got the room of requirement. Customize this room. I so choose to. Told off. Meet, here I come. What is the paper? Market for potions, are we? Yeah. What can I do for you today? A wise decision. Thank you. I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. I 
I delivered the potions to Fatima Luang. <laughs> Fatty, what now? And uh, did she cause you any trouble? <clears throat> Nothing to worry about. I handled it. Glad to hear it. And thank you again for your help. It was a pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Pippin. Likewise. <laughs> Worth every bit of that delivery fee to have someone capable deal with that witch. By the way, I found this book of potion recipes in Kingbridge. Might it be useful to you? Is this Fatima's recipe book? Oh, I had no idea it was hers. Some things are sacred amongst potioners. I shall return it to her immediately. Rebellion. Did I have the courage to go into the forest? Pardon me, but were you saying something? Oh, hello. Talking to myself. I'm Clementine. Willetsy. Charmed. I was musing on the precious butterflies I see near the edge of the forest. Whenever I come near, they fly off into it. When I was at Hogwarts, we truly were forbidden from entering the forest. Told horrible stories about it, and I've had an irrationally intense fear of it ever since. It's silly, but I'm insatiably curious as to where the butterflies go in the forest. You couldn't possibly find out. Could you? You want me to follow the butterflies? I do, yes. Follow if the spiders. Mind. Very well. If I have That's time, probably a I shall see where they lead. Oh, how can we have followed the butterflies? These days have so much more courage than I ever did. Follow you can the usually bloody find me right spiders. around here. I hope to see you soon. Follow the butterflies. Don't forget. The butterflies always seem to be on the fringes of the Forbidden Forest. Good luck! Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. <laughs> Nice to see you, my young friend. <laughs> there they are. She wasn't making it up. Well, we've come this far. Miss Willardsy might get an answer about these bugs. Oh, 
I think he's dead. I wasn't following the butterflies. Whoopsie daisies. Miss Willardsy will never believe where the butterflies led me. To some flowers, I guess. <laughs> Collect my reward. Rebellion. What's my reward? They won't do. Let's collect your reward, but where is my reward? Revelio. Oh, it's a chest. Well, well. I didn't see. Look what we have here. I didn't see the chest. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? Folks, oh, please tell me you have an answer for me about the butterfly. Hello, Miss Willardsy. Well, what happened? Did you find them? Yeah. They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely. I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. <sighs> Perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see, should I dare. Oh. Uh -oh. Butterfly. Ah, uh, you can loosen up the symbol usage if you want, Kit. I don't know how to use Nightbot, so... I have to give you permission. All right, Kat, how do I do that? <laughs> you gotta tell me more, because I don't know.
New manager. All right. Uh, done. Done. Those. There you go. You're a manager now. Night Dancer Baru. Yeah, no links. No links in the chat. Also, I want people to stop saying dot com and stuff like that by actually spelling out dot like dot com dot space com. <laughs> It's like, hey, would you like followers? Go to this site, but you have to type it in yourself. Uh, bandaword.com. Yeah, sure. That works. Do that. Because who would say .com like that, really? Apart from someone trying to scam you. And how would one like to be styled today? Hello. Hello. Oh, come in. Come in. Welcome to Madam Snelling's Tress Emporium. <laughs> I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. Madam Smelly. They used to call me Snelly. Oh, Snelly. Why aren't you studying to be an aura? But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust at the ministry and I'm here thriving. Absolutely thriving. But look at you. Look at... You. I can certainly see why you paid me a visit. Looking for a change, are we? Excuse me. Why not, I say? What sort of change? Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? You can change your hair too if you'd like. What services do you offer? What is it you might be so interested in? So I can remake my guy at five so fuel if I need. Okay. Oh no, it's just cosmetic stuff. I can't change the shape of his head. Oh yeah, cat. Earlier when I started the stream, I had someone asking to add them on Discord about them making me stuff. You can stop by anytime. They wanted me to post a thing into the chat. Even after I said no. So I assume it's a bot. Yeah, I'll I'll scroll up and I'll take a screenshot of what it looks like. So you can pick and choose. 
what you want to ban from that s chat messages. There. Yeah, it was a bot because they didn't respond to what I was telling them. Is that a dodo? Bruh. I told you not to go down that path. Miss Peck from Rude and Peck said a customer lost a Deeracle around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got us in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Cats. There's two of them. Meow. <coughs> oh, I can go to Professor now and get another spell. Wherever he is. Uh. Yeah, I pinned something. I don't know how to unpin it. It won't let me. What are you up to now? This message is already pinned. I can't unpin it. You unpinned it for me. Okay, thanks. Wait, where am I going? I don't want to go up there. See, Cat, you need to join my streams more often so you can <laughs> moderate it more. What happened to the host button? I haven't been able to host you or Cat in a long time. I don't know. No idea. When you get a chance, can you link me to their... Who's, who's profile? The one, okay. I'll I'll copy and paste their user name. There. I copy and pasted it. I did report it. I think. No, I didn't. No, I didn't report it. No. All right. So, yeah, you can report it for me. You can't imagine how inconvenient. Hello, Professor. Hey, Cat, look at this Professor. What do you think of him? Have you finished your assignments? I finished the tasks, Professor. Well, what do you well, think of this man? I trust you are meticulous in your efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to shortcomings. He said coming. Yes, sir, of course. Good. Ordinarily, I'd say it's not my concern either way, but you... I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame to let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't it's called Professor Sharp because he's head. legend. Now, <laughs> let's see how you fare with Defendo. Wand at the ready. Defendo. Focus. Defendo can be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Of course, the guy called Professor Shah, the Edge Lord teacher, teaches me a move to cut. Hmm. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defendo. I would encourage you once again to practice here in the classroom, for your sake and that of everyone else. <laughs> Did I do anything with her Discord server? No. No.
They just asked for my username, like the account ID thing. I just ignored them. <laughs> what do you mean, my Discord? What are you talking about? A link timer? What? I don't understand what you're trying to ask. My disc was dead. You use yours for stream pings only. Well, I have that set up already. to have a student who actually heeds instruction. Every now and then, Nightbot posts a link to your YouTube. Do you want me to make another for your Discord? No. No. That's not worth it. As I mentioned earlier, Defendo can be versatile but dangerous. Are you continuing to practice? This new cut spell sucks. Use fire. Thanks, Spelly Armish. Gave a link, SP. I can add sound effects to your channel points if you want someday. What? How nice to see you, my young friend. Don't I have to do that on Streamlabs as well? Cat, you swore. You said fucking. Cat, you don't swear. You swore. Over here. Hello, Sebastian. <laughs> Sebastian, it's been a while. It has. Glad you received my owl. I have something to show you. First, let me thank you for what you did in the library. Of course. Scribner tried to give me detention, but I have ways out of these things. Well, you took the fall for me, and that counts for something. Did you find what you were looking for? I did, but something was missing. I'm not sure here is the best place to discuss it. Understood. We can talk more in a moment, in the Undercroft. No, you can not just even the professors know about this place. This way. Also, hush. There's a secret passage just here. 
It's well disguised. Secret passage. Nintendo Direct is about to start. Okay. Alright, I'll, I'll put the Nintendo Direct How did you find on, this but place? I'm gonna mute it. My friend, on my on, uh, he PC noises, so you can't hear it. We used to play Gobstones here all the time. With my sister, Anne. I'll watch she it while playing the game. Infernal game. What I wouldn't give to lose to her again. I should tell you, I swore to Ominous I would safeguard this place. Uh. So please, keep this between us. He never confides in anyone. But he's trusted me since the day we met. I wouldn't want to jeopardize that. We used to sneak in here Pikmin. almost daily. We've never been caught. Pikmin 4. I think I've seen ominous in potions. Or was it herbology? I've noticed that he uses his wand to navigate the castle. He does. No idea how, though. Ominous was born blind, and no spell could reverse it. His wand seems almost Oh boy, look at those last-gen Not surprising, I suppose. <laughs> Ollivander always says, the wand chooses the wizard. Is that how he found this place? No, someone in his family knew about it. The Gaunts are full of secrets. I've never heard anyone else speak of it. And I've certainly never seen anyone else here. Again, mention this to no one, especially Ominous. He has no love lost for his family or their secrets. But this place is special to him. Understood. But why does Ominous have no love lost for his family? His father's family are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin. Actually, you know what? I'm going to watch this direct later. Obsessed it's with blood status, me. most of them. Ominous cannot abide them, as he'll be the first to tell you. Anyway, the Undercroft has been a perfect place to sneak off to away from prying eyes, and even practice otherwise forbidden spells. Really? Like what? Like the blasting curse. Professors say it's not an appropriate spell to teach students. A proper magical education ought to include all magic. My thoughts exactly. A spell like Confringo is only truly dangerous in untrained hands. Such spells should be properly taught, not banned. To be fair, I'm admittedly partial to more fiery forms of magic, but you should learn it. I can teach it to you safely here. Dark magic. It may take a while to get the feel for it. Mimic my wand movement. The incantation is Confringo. Very well. Confringo. You're getting it. Ready to actually try it out? You're Stick adding new sound effects to my channel. Best what? to keep the Undercroft intact. Bruh. Have a go at those candelabras. Both have their uses, but I think you'll find that a Confringo cast travels a bit farther than that of a spell like Incendio. Rebellion. Uh. Ooh. Confringo! Nice work! Fire blast! How's it feel? It's a tad hot. Fire blast! You're... That's it! Fire blast! I think I've got well it! Done. You were out earlier, that's why you couldn't join straight away. Oh, don't worry about that. I have to say, I enjoyed that. The first time Ominous and I practiced Confringo, we singed our eyebrows. <laughs> I would have paid to see that. I swore we'd never live it down. So this day, there's something about that spell that's addictive. Thank you for the pets too. The blast does heat things up. <laughs> I see how you lost your eyebrows. <laughs> You'll get used to it. And Ominous and I used to practice down here for hours. The Undercroft was our retreat. I haven't been here in some time. It's not the same without Anne. I'm sorry about your sister. If 
there's anything I can do. Perhaps when I next head to Feldcroft, you could come along. Me, Tan. She could use some cheering up. Just let me know when and I'll meet you. Oh, she misses Hogwarts. She's been stuck at home with our guardian, Uncle Solomon. Unfortunately, you'll have to meet him too. Well, meeting a new student will be precisely what she needs. I shall look forward to it. Cheers. By the way, what was it you couldn't discuss out in the hall earlier? I'm not sure where to start. You said something was missing from what you found in the library. I assume it's to do with what you told me. About the port key and Gringotts and Ranrock. Nothing gets past you. And yes, it is. As I'm sure you suspect, there is a bit more to all of this. I'm listening. You must promise to keep this between us. I trusted you with knowledge of this secret Undercroft. You can trust me. All right. I can see traces of ancient magic. Ancient magic? I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. What does that even mean? Honestly, I'm not entirely certain. All I know is that I can see whispers of an old magic that hardly anyone else can. Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. And this ability of yours, does it allow you to wield this magic too? I... I, I don't know. Well, when you do know, tell me. I've been studying archaic forms of magic for ages. Perhaps we can help each other. In the meantime, with both Rookwood and Ranrock after you, I suspect a bit more time practicing the blasting curses in order. Spend as much time here as you'd like. And remember, keep this place between us. Another secret when ring. When I head to Feldcroft, I'll send you an owl. Huzzah. Confringo! <laughs> I have a gun. Kaboom. Revelio. Hello, Sebastian. Wait. You there? I can hear you. Oh, hello. Ominous, isn't it? I believe we have potions together. And herbology? I recognize that voice. Heard you talking to Gareth Weasley in potions class. You're the new fifth year. Did you just come from the Undercroft? How did you get in there? That room's called the Undercroft. Ah, well, I was exploring and then suddenly found myself in a strange passageway. Don't lie to me. No one stumbles upon that room. Sebastian told you, didn't he? You breathe a word about this place to anyone, and not even your precious Professor Fig will be able to help you. My father is friends with you the headmaster. I had text I'm not afraid to exploit that connection if I need to. Uh... How? Trust me, Ominous. I want the text to speak thing that's also and a Sebastian pet. is a good oh, friend. You, you shouldn't immediately assume the worst of him. I don't need you to tell me about my oldest friend. Thank you very much. Ominous, I just meant I know what you I, meant. I you. I don't... Sebastian gets himself in enough trouble. Uh... He doesn't need your help. Sebastian is going to get an earful about this. Uh. Uh. For the 
the Tesla Sweet Puppet thing, you uh, have to figure that Well, you have to pay for it. It's a different thing. Come and see me as soon as you can. I've returned from a rather unproductive trip to the Ministry, hoping your time has been more fruitful than mine. I learned a naughty spell. I would like to teach you Wingardium Leviosa. It can be used in a short time. Once you've completed a few prerequisite tasks, do see me after class. Wingardium Leviosa, I could go learn it. I want Wingardium Leviosa. Oh. Acquire and use a Mandrake on multiple enemies. Guardian what? What do you know about Guardian what? Lumos. If you put a foot wrong, it's just well, there's a rather foul odor. Oh dear. Stinky. Revelio. Lumos. If you step in the wrong place and become engulfed in a stench, well, be it on your own head, it is not my doing. Stinky corridor. <clears throat> Revelio. I love lock the doors. Lock it the door to this.
Revelio. Revelio. Arthur, I hear you, Arthur. Where are you, my boy? Arthur, where are you? Arthur, are you in the bathroom? Are you in here, Arthur? Can I use Repario? Repero on the toilet. Repero. Oh, oh, stinky. Oh my dear, you look simply. Where are we going? Did I beat Red Dead 2? Yes, I did beat Red Dead 2. You would know if you watched. Revelio. Ooh. All right, three, zero, two. Two. Right, so unicorn is one, five, okay, seven, what's well, seven? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, so that thing's seven. something terrible happened. What happened? Oh, your dog step. Okay. You're doing the funny haha -ha joke. Cats being Amanda. What's her name? Amanda Heard? Off on another adventure, are we? Revelio. Where am I going? Downstairs.
<coughs> Cat, no sending links in my chat. It's against the rules. I was hoping to see you. You're back. Finally. Minister Spavin talks more than he listens. Ranted on and on about rogue dragons. Wouldn't listen to a word about goblins. Speaking of which... Listen, Professor. So much happened while you were away. Eldridge Diggory's portrait in the common room told me about his great niece, Helen. His great niece? Yes, she used to be an aura. Well... She took me to Azkaban to meet Anne Thisby. You went to Azkaban? Quite an experience. <laughs> but you see, Anne knew Richard Jackdaw before he died, so I had to find his ghost. Who on earth is Richard Jackdaw? He was a student here long ago. Anyway, he told me about a secret cavern. I went there, and right next to Jackdaw's skeleton, I found the missing pages. You found the pages? I did. And because Jackdaw had followed the map they contained, when I found the pages, I found the location on the map. Believe it or not, it's a room below Hogwarts. Why am I not surprised? Shall we? I was hoping you'd say that. Oh, and we'll need to bring the book. The book. The room is called the map chamber, by the way. And a portrait of Percival Rackham awaits us there. Professor Rackham. I look forward to meeting him. How did this Jackdaw get the pages from the book? Evidently, Peeves stole them, and Jackdaw stole them from him. Oh, Peeves. To think it was beneath us all this time. If only you were here to see this. Ooh. Hello, Professor Rackham. We've placed the book on the pedestal as you asked. And this is my mentor, Professor Fig. How do you do, Professor Fig? And you, my young friend. See now why you needed to return with the book? I do. I also see why you refer to this room as the map chamber. That you have come this far tells me that you possess extraordinary magical ability. The potential and power of which will unlock should you prove yourself worthy. The location of each of four trials will, in time, appear on the map. Trials that will test you and give you access to invaluable knowledge. Trials that you must complete on your own. Do you recall the pensive memory you viewed in my vaulting Gringotts? You and your friend Charles spoke of the port key and of trials you'd created for one who could see traces of ancient magic. Precisely. Charles is another of the keepers, a designation we gave ourselves centuries ago in light of the knowledge that we have been bound to keep hidden. 
Until, perhaps, now. So, the passage from your ruins to Gringotts, everything in the vault, the restricted section, finding this room, none of these was a trial. They were an important part of the journey, but they were not trials themselves. The fact that you have come this far, however, bodes well. The trials were designed to ensure that the power and knowledge we have kept secret for so long does not fall into the wrong hands. They will test your abilities, both innate and learned. But of equal importance, everything you witness as you complete the trials will inform what you choose to do with all that we share. You will need patience. The trials have much to teach you. It will take time. I'm afraid we don't have the luxury of time. We have waited this long, Professor Fig. Surely a few more. Respectfully, sir, while I do not know the secret you keep, I do know that our young friend here has seen traces... traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. And we encountered an uncommonly powerful goblin wielding such magic as we prepared to leave your vault at Gringotts. We may already be too late. This is grave news indeed. Young friend, do you trust Professor Fig? I do. Then, in the light of your considerable skill and all you have already accomplished, we shall begin. You will find the location of the first trial marked on the map below you. Whilst Professor Fig may assist you in locating the trials, they may be completed only by one with our ability. Shall we have a look? I know that tower. It's not far. You may have seen it yourself. It looks familiar. <laughs> Perhaps your young friend is more well-traveled than you might think. As your mentor, the least I can do is go ahead to make sure it is safe. Join me as soon as you can. I'll find you at the tower as soon as I can. Until then, be careful, and do not tell anyone where you're going. Ah. Magic. Handy resource indeed. Your it's the freezing spell. Yeah, that trial between Johnny Depp and An Amber Heard was a complete joke. It is an efficient way to cool down a heated situation. But first, I will need you to complete a few tasks. Once you've done that, come and see me. Marvelous strike! Confringo! What? You're a slipper. No. Revelio. Was a 
true. Troll bogeys. Good cabbage. said that travel broadens the mind.
over here. Hello, old man. We're not alone. We are not. Ranrock's loyalists. Around a dozen, I can see, but could be more. Can't we operate past them into the tower? We could, but we've no idea what's in the tower. More importantly, however, I'd like to know why they're here. They've set up camp just ahead. I suggest we investigate a little before doing anything else. Let's go. Well, this isn't ideal. No, it isn't. This way. And I suggest we use the disillusionment charm here. No sense in announcing our arrival. Quickly now! Ooh. Assassination! Stay hidden and cast your to Talus. To Talus. <laughs> well done. Uh, it must be assassination. Someone there. Patrick is down there. Quite. <laughs> Stealthy boy. Huh? Orders directly from Ranrock. These orders indicate that they're after something to do with names. What names? And I will draw blood. Easily divert. Ah! 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 Right there, did. Revelio. My controller batteries are low. Rebellion. Can't imagine the goblins know about the trials. They know that something is significant about this place, though. Looks like we found the entrance. It's locked. Uh, 
An unlocking charm. Very handy. No time now, but if you don't learn it soon enough, we can work on it back at the castle. Rebellion. I imagine these rooms have been enchanted for centuries. Welcome to San Bacar's Tower. Hello, Professor. Did you say Sam Bacar's tower? I did. Professor Bacar is a keeper you have yet to encounter. I'm glad to see that I was correct in presuming that we would meet again soon after our last encounter. Though I surmise, based on the commotion I heard, that you did not have an easy time getting to me. We did not, Professor. We encountered goblins outside the tower. That goblins were aware of my vault is disquieting enough. But if they have also made a connection to this tower, then the threat may be greater than I thought. All the more reason for us to move forward. Downstairs, near the entry, a reservoir of ancient magic, like those you've seen before, has been unlocked. Commanded to access a doorway. I'm afraid I cannot say more. As Professor Fig cannot join you, he and I will, in time, see you back at the map chamber. Remember what you see. Okay. We're going to need to understand how Ranrock's loyalists knew about a tower that once belonged to a keeper. For the moment, however, you've more important things to set your mind to. A reservoir of ancient magic, I believe? Yes, sir. Then I shall leave matters in your increasingly capable hands. That said, be careful. I will, sir. I'll see you back in the map chamber. I want to learn how to unlock magic. the doors. Downstairs, near the entry. First trial. I've seen this before in Gringotts and the restricted section. Rebellion. Firebird. Impressive. That must have done something. Best have a look around. Money. Traces of ancient magic. Something must be different. <laughs> Revelio. Hmm, portal. The 
these are never a welcome sight. At least I know what to expect this time. These look familiar. Akio. statues. Rebellion. Rebellion. I presume I'm looking for traces of ancient magic. You presume, do you? But where? Bro, who the heck is Drapsnat in the chat list? I don't know. There's a bunch of people in there I don't know. But they're clearly not here. They like 
click on the stream and then click off it again probably and then their, their names get left on the list How do I get this on the other side? What did that burst of magic change on both sides of the archway? Something must be different. Seems I ought to explore this archway from both sides. Hmm. Oh. Magic. Akio. A dev of what? So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. So that's it. I need to use both sides of the archway to get the platform to the other side of the bridge. Rebellion. I'll never get used to these floors. The floor is moving. Stupid one. 
Good bring up. Expel the armors. Let me go. Akio. Ah. I win. Revelio. Rebellion. Doesn't come through. Magic time to do to do. Now to see what's uh. changed on each side of this archway. Gee, it would be nice if I could get my broom out. Rebellion. It gave me potions. I wonder if I'm gonna have a fight. Messages. Confer 
Destroy it as it's charging. Okay. Oh, using the same attack. shooting at me now. Oh no! Ah! Someone shot me.
How do I destroy the orb? Oh, you have to use the right color. Figure it out. <coughs> what a relief. Ooh. Revelio. Another pensive. Figure the world around you is remarkable. What is it? My father isn't getting better. I don't think he'll ever recover from the death of my brother. It is agonizing to see those we love suffer. The trout was years ago. The pain of losing I got him, a to him now as if it had happened only yesterday. He doesn't need pretty pillars, he needs peace. What if I could help him, Professor? You do so much for your father already. It's not enough. I want to take away his pain. It is tempting, I know, to use this magic that you're mastering to transfigure more than the physical world. But human emotion is a potent force unto itself. Even the most well-meaning and competent witch cannot possibly know the consequences of irrevocably manipulating it. So I'm to watch as my father's pain destroys him. It is not your pain to take. Every year, a student sees something sillier than I could ever imagine in their tea leaves. Oh, Miss Morgana, welcome back to Hogwarts, Professor. That's going to take some getting used to. Mm. Professor Rickwood? I was so pleased to hear that you'd accepted the position of Defense Against the Dark Arts, Professor. Sit, sit, Isadora. Tell us about your travels. I was actually hoping that you and the others might join me at my home this evening. There's much I'd like to share with you. That would be delightful. We shall let the others know. Very well. I shall see you then.
Hmm. Hmm. Another memory. Now to find a way out of here. Rebellion. Is there any more loot? More crystallized stone. That must be the way back to the map chamber. What have we here? I'm a student at Hogwarts, sir. And this is Professor Fig. Professor Charles Rookwood at your service. Has someone completed the first trial? I have, Professor. Rookwood. We saw you in the pensive in Gringotts, with Professor Rackham. Indeed. So, you found the port key to access Professor Rackham's vault, and you deciphered the map within the locket you found floating above that pensive. I did. I found something that I can't identify floating above the last pensive. Ah, yes. You will find a similar artifact in each trial. You must take care to keep them safe. You will need them to complete the journey we have set forth for you. Once you have them all, we will tell you what to do with them. Very well. Are you able to tell me anything about the next trial? Before you proceed, I would like to speak with Charles regarding the urgent situation involving the goblins. The goblins? The student has seen traces of a powerful dark magic being wielded by goblin kind. They and their mentor, Professor Fig, not only encountered goblins lurking outside of San Bacar's tower, they also encountered a powerful goblin in my vault at Gringotts. Hmm. I'm afraid it would be wise to halt the trials until we know more. We shall defer to you in this matter. Of course. Now then... Wait, Professor. The name Rookwood. Do you think... That there's a connection to Victor? Perhaps. But we can't be sure of its significance, if any. For now, tell me what you saw in the pensive. Before the witch from the last pensive, Isadora, became a Hogwarts professor, she argued with Professor Rackham about using magic to remove pain. Hmm. Hopefully the next pensive provides more context. For now, we should learn what Ramrock knows. I will be honest, I've no idea where to start. Actually, I might know of someone. I saw Serona at the Three Broomsticks speaking to a goblin once. They seemed friendly. Well, it's worth a try. See what you can find out. Of course, don't forget... My studies. <coughs> yes, sir. Uh, before you go... Uh -huh. Professor? Have you encountered swirling traces of magic in the world? Uh, aside from those along our path? Not that I recall. What are they? Evidence of the Keeper's efforts to manipulate the power of ancient magic during our time. If I am correct, and I usually am, you should be able to use them to inform and enhance your own magic. Thank you, sir. I will look out for them. Hmm.
bird. I should ask Serona at the... I've got spectacular news. The broom upgrade's ready. Ha! Stop by the shop when you can. Broom upgrade. I hope you will come and see me about a pressing and highly confidential matter at your earliest convenience. I believe that we may be able to help each other. Look at what I got. It's Dark Souls. Please see me after class once you have completed the tasks I've set for you. I would like to teach you to send off useful for pulling objects to the ground. I have a bunch of things to do. What are you up to now? Dark Souls! Dark Souls! Dark Souls! Balloon! Yeah. 
Here it is. Oh, these are a different batch. Oh, there it is. I see it. Meet, here I come. Revelio. Hello there. Nice to see you. Serona. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help with Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two are nothing but trouble. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lodgog. <laughs> He's a friend. It seems as though you were on good terms with him. I've known him for years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. I hadn't seen him in years when he came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. It took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lodgok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him, about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend Rookwood. It is. If he's not here, you might find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards, even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for information on Ranrock to help rein him in, you'll find an ally in Lodgok. Thank you, Serona. If you find Lodgok, please give him my best. Okay. I don't know what you've done to make such powerful enemies, but please, watch your back. Welcome back. I've arranged a special price on the broom upgrade for you. I truly appreciate all of your help. You'll be thrilled with that broom, I promise you. Ah. Thanks for stopping by. I must tell you, half of Ogsmead's been by the shop asking about rumours of a broom upgrade. Without the information you provided, my work would have taken twice as long. Thank you again. It may sound ambitious, but I've already begun work on another upgrade, more difficult to perfect than the last. I wondered, would you be interested in joining forces again? There's another course near Irondale that Miss Reyes has mastered. If you were to test this first upgrade there, it may help me as I develop the next. 
Oh, you'll consider it, won't you? Yes. Sounds as if you're really outdoing yourself. If I'm able to help, I will. Thank you. I know this recent success was only the beginning of what I can do for Broom Flight. Report back as soon as you can, and we'll be off to the... Room. Ooh, that's a nice broom. broom. He already said it's a discount for me for the upgrades. I think all the brooms are the same. They just have cosmetic differences. Off to the races then. Yeah, the broom looks nice. Apparently I have better acceleration now or something. What's the pulse again? Uh, yeah, yeah. the boss that could push me away. <clears throat> right, let's find an enemy to use it on. 
Who lived here, I wonder? Ish. Launch a burning enemy. Oh, I can get a uh, pumpkin mask. Nice. Wee. Cast a pulse on a levitating enemy. How's not? How's my new baby boy doing? Fine. My new fish is okay. I'm gonna name it Arthur. I'm not going to name it Sausage. This place has seen better days. Repairer. Levy open. <laughs> A 
Where's the way out? Rebellion. Interesting. Bone stairs. Wizard souls. Since you're not in work tomorrow, I'll do a stream earlier just for you. I'll do it like midday or something. <coughs> I need to get a mandrake. I imagine I can get one at the potion shop. No. Where? Uh. Over here. Yeah, over here. You see, I'll be able to get steeds for one. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. I kind of like wearing the armor, but I kind of want to not wear it at the same time. So I'll leave it on. Greetings! For now. Please take your time looking about. Oh. Uh, now, you let me know if there's anything else I can help you with. Yeah, I want Mandrake. You have a good head for business, haven't you? Yeah. Your mom doesn't want you to go on strike, but it's nothing to do with her, so she can mind her own business.
Where do I get Mandrake? No one can say I don't keep a stack shelf. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Hmm. I hope to see you again. What can I do for you today? It looks like G Man. What you mean from Half Lot? I hope to see you again. Farewell for now. I don't see it. Maybe the hairline. Where do I get a mandrake? Revelio. Can I buy it off my teacher or something? Akio. You could probably grow your own, but where do I get seeds? Where's the seeds? Revelio. Oh, the shop get shot. any more cozy than Hogsmeade. Dogweed and death cap. You can buy fully grown mandrakes for 500 or seeds at 800. Yeah, but where? Where is that? Dogweed and death cap. Seeing it. Maybe it's not there. Oh, there it is. It's up the hill. Come on inside. Oh, watch yourself, though. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry, I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. 
I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Or if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and I'm in no mood for a clear-up. Bruh. What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? I want this rat. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Yeah. Oh, I'm always thrilled when a young one makes a wise purchase. I can tell you'll go far. Hee <laughs> hee. All right, now to throw a mandrake in the middle of a group of enemies. Fox meat, here I come. Uh. Let me fly. Let me fly, game. There we go. I gotta find a group of enemies. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. Yeah, I came here before. Whoa. What do you mean this is no place for a broom? Are you high? You're supposed to say bicycle from Pokemon. That wasn't so difficult. I need to find a group of enemies. Hey, a cat just spawned in. Hello, cat. Meow. Revelio. There's a couple over here. I'll stick them like a knocktail. I'll sneak over and throw at them. I'm trying to do the challenge. 
for ages since I found anything worth poaching near Crackcroft. That's something. Potato! Stupefy! Confringo! Accio! Where'd it go? It isn't. Defonso! Ready to take a hit, are you? Accio! I murdered a man. The beasts around here can sleep a bit easier now. Did I do my challenge? All right, cool. I can, I can, I'll, I'll learn these spells tomorrow. I, I've just unlocked the requirements for them. I can get the spells tomorrow. I'm gonna go save and quit. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Alright, save and quit. I played 11 hours. Alright, hope you enjoyed watching the Bloodshot you were playing, and I will see you probably tomorrow. Bye bye.